Welcome to Lobby 99. This one minute example will help you understand discussions on tax policy by explaining two types of income tax rates. Meet Buck and Penny. Buck's income last year was 10 coins. Penny earned 25 coins. Under the United States Graduated Tax Code, everyone pays the same tax rate on the same part of their income. The percentage goes up on income only above certain thresholds. Let's say the tax rate on income up to 10 coins is 10%. As you can see, Buck and Penny each pay the exact same amount, one coin, on their first 10 coins of income. But Penny earned more than 10 coins. Continuing this example, we'll say that the tax rate on income earned beyond 10 coins, but only up to 20 coins, is 30%. So for the next 10 coins of Penny's income, she'll pay 3 coins in taxes. And finally, we'll say that all income above 20 coins will be taxed at 80%. So Penny's tax on the five coins she earned after her first 20 coins will be four coins. We call the highest percentage someone paid on any part of their income their marginal tax rate. So in this case, Buck's marginal tax rate was 10%. His average tax rate, the total amount he paid on all his income, also was 10%. Although Penny had to pay 80% on only a few of her earned coins, we still say her marginal tax rate was 80%. Overall, however, she paid only 32% of her income in taxes, so we say her average tax rate was 32%. And note this, even though Penny paid much more in taxes than Buck, she still ended up keeping about twice as much as him after taxes. Thanks for watching this. We hope that now you'll have a clearer perspective on discussions involving income tax rates and policies.